all right so i had a couple of people hit me up asking what is going on with this new old king thanos or thanos wins uniform and why no one is using it in pvp why you don't see a lot of content creators making videos showcasing this man in pvp where they say he's supposed to be dominant and the truth of the matter is not more was dragging their hands on this one and this man is currently bugged and i'm not sure if they're doing it so that they can boost sales for the wise harvester what they don't need to do that and i'm making this video to point out that they don't need to do that because the wise harvester is very very powerful for pve content and there's a clear distinction there so they don't need to arbitrarily sit on their hands and wait around for people to make their decision buy this one and then go back and buff this one later they don't need to do that then marble you don't need to do that okay just let people enjoy playing with Thanos wins at his full potential or your intended full potential for him because as of right now if you take a look at his stats he's 100 not taking full advantage of what he's supposed to have so from what i can see here the super armor and the all defense is not being applied i'm not too sure about the 30 percent extra damage to superheroes and that is a pretty big deal because one of the most powerful characters in this game is a superhero that plagues pvp and that is adam warlock if you take a look at the Thanos' stats right here in this uniform, you'll see in my account, he has 38,000 physical defense and 36,000 energy defense. That is without him being on a team. Now, if I put Thanos on a team by himself and then go ahead and put him in the leadership role, his leadership gives him 50% attack and 40% defense. Cool. Take a look at his stats now. It's up 46,000 physical and 44,000 energy. So clearly if you put his leadership in play it gives him extra defense and extra attack however if i just swap the uniform you will notice that absolutely nothing changes and this is important okay things are supposed to change these stats here are supposed to be the defensive stats anyways are supposed to be a little bit weaker in the farmer thanos uniform because farmer thanos doesn't have this additional line of text on the hero killer passive you can see it's true peace it gives him extra damage to superheroes and extra damage to super villain nothing here says 50 percent extra all defense or super armor so how is it on god's green earth that they have the same amount of defenses clearly that says to me that the four star passive for the old king thanos is not working properly the healing is still happening that's fine but the 50 percent extra defense and the extra damage to superhero it's a toss-up we don't know if it's actually being applied so because of that i'm avoiding using him because i don't want to basically make a video of him being weaker than he's supposed to be and have people thinking you know this guy is trash because he's getting slapped up by all of the pvp medals so i've been waiting it's been over a week and they still have not addressed this so that's why you're not seeing me pump out pvp videos with Thanos. i'm waiting for them to buff him i'm waiting for them to fix this and i'm not going to take my cdp of rage off this guy build him with an authority or a conquest just to test him in pvp at not his full potential then have to do the whole thing over again because i know for me i'm going to keep that also the cdp of rage so i'll be swapping my rage off for a couple different pvp builds and then having to do the whole thing over after they buff him i just don't feel like doing that okay so that's why you're not seeing me do pvp videos with nanos i'm gonna wait until they eventually because they have to eventually fix that situation secondly i see a bunch of people not that many but quite a few few enough for me to actually want to showcase this people saying that this man is weak for pve just because the wise harvester is stronger does not by any means make old king thanos weak for pve and truthfully speaking i am going to buy thanos wins for old king thanos on my free to play account over the wise harvester simply because it is a cheaper alternative for an account that doesn't have although i don't have really truly endless crystals on my paywall account i have less crystals 
on my free to play account so i am going to go with the cheaper alternative because it is effective enough for pve content and i also have the extra value for pvp so that being said i'm going to take him in i'm going to show you guys how he performs on the black swan world boss legend plus fight and i'm also going to do a wise harvester run as well just so you guys can see the difference in clear speed and damage between the two so yes this one is more powerful but that does not mean that this one is weak all right let's do it so stage nine is the highest we have unlocked just for now because I didn't pay to unlock the boss early, so I'm a couple days behind all the people who paid. But it's all good. Eventually we'll catch up. Okay. Really? For some reason, the third skill didn't go off. Alright. Gonna go ahead and just toss out that. You're not gonna move, right? Get this work. That first skill hits surprisingly hard for a, a PvP skill, to be honest. Aw, oh, come on. That third skill and the range issue on it is kind of annoying sometimes. See, like, look at this. You can activate the... Hold on. You can activate the four and the five from much further away than the third skill. Good thing I didn't use my tier three there. Okay, let's put her in the corner here and put her in her place. Gonna stop hitting her right now. Come over here. Easy peasy. I just stand over here in this corner. We can easily dodge two out of three of these. That's easy. Last one here. I haven't bothered to, to learn the patterns for this one. To be honest with you, like it, it, it's really annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Like it's really difficult to see where you're supposed to be. It's not as clear as the other patterns. Gonna just go ahead and keep hitting and easily push you out of that phase. Or maybe it's just me, but that, I don't know, that one there specifically, tough to see where you're supposed to be. Like this one is easy enough, you can kind of read it as it spins, but I usually just push through it. So, yeah, not bad for a PvP character. Let me show you how much faster or better the wise harvester uniform is and then you can make your decision if you're still on the fence now i'd be lying to you if i told you it was an easy decision to skip over wise harvester and just go with thanos wins because it's not an easy decision it's a smart decision if you're strained for crystals to get one of them at least because thanos i think in my opinion at this point in the game it must have tier four i don't know why that third skill on both uniforms Nah, seems to give a little bit of problem from time to time there. I'm gonna press this girl with this last skill here. And then let loose 
for a massive burst of damage. Easy peasy. So yeah, definitely not a wise decision. <laughs> if uh, if you care about like pushing the highest levels possible in uh, PVE content to skip over this if you have the crystals to spare. It's um, a monster of a uniform, bro. It really is. Just ran through that invisible wall that's supposed to be there. Who cares what's supposed to be there? Bro, I'm Thanos. I always win. I do what I want, not what I can. Know your place. Jeez. Look at the difference in damage, bro. It's actually nuts. Okay. Let me get out of that. Crazy. But yeah. Let me just uh, see if I can dodge this next one. Okay. 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 So, I guess I'm getting better at uh, dodging that shit. But uh, <laughs> yeah, it's not as easy to see as some of the other patterns and, and the other bosses. Or even in this fight. Some of her moves are telegraphed and whatnot. We can see it's, it's definitely significantly easier to kill this girl with a wise harvester. Obviously, Thanos wins. Old King Thanos can do it as well, but this one is significantly stronger. So I'm not sure why they're refusing to address and expeditiously fix this old King Thanos uniform. All right, stop shafting the man. Let the people who want to use him with a PvP build actually do so effectively using his Hero Slayer passive. And let me actually see if it's worth taking my CDP of Rage off this man and running him with a full-time pvp build because as of right now if i'm not going to get the extra defense and the super armor and, and who knows if the hero part is even working there's no way i'm going to strip my build pay 800 crystals to then have to put my ctp of rage back on him you know the only plus side that could come from that is if i take this off and he's shit in pvp or not in the top five conversation in pvp i'll just straight go to a brilliant because i love my thanos right so anyways guys i'm gonna wrap it up here leave me your thoughts in the comments on thanos wins do you think since he's significantly weaker i would say about 30 percent weaker than harvester thanos that means he's a weak character for pve like i don't think that's the case you can be strong and not be the strongest.